Another aspect of sound is the loudness of sound. Now, what does the loudness of sound depend on? Point number six shows two particles. Particle one, the farthest that particle one can go from the rest position is this distance. Let's call it X. For particle two, where it vibrates, the farthest that can go away from the rest position is this distance Y. From the diagram, you can see that Y is greater than X. We say that X is the amplitude of the vibration of particle one. We say that Y is the amplitude of the vibration of particle two. You can tell that the amplitude of vibration of particle two is greater than that of particle one. Therefore, the sound produced by particle two's vibration will be louder than the sound produced by particle one's vibration. So the amplitude of the particle's vibration, we say that is the amplitude of the sound that is produced. The loudness of the sound depends on that. The louder the sound is, the greater the amplitude of vibration. The softer the sound is, the smaller the amplitude of vibration.